I'm going to go back really prior to the prior to the trial, and, I, and I'll and I'll catch up with the trial here in a second. Prior to the trial, I mean, you you you've buried your wife. You, Actually, spread her ashes where she was baptized. Believe it or not, you know, it was uh, my kids didn't know what to do, obviously. And I told them, look, your mother, to come to this one place to visit your mother is really not necessary. She's going in the water where she always loved to be. So anywhere there's water, you can visit your mom. You don't have to be here at this particular point. You can be at a lake in North Carolina or in England or wherever. Wherever there's water, you're going to be able to associate with your mother. So... Describe, because no one in this room knows what it's like to have a loved one taken from them by another human being. So my question is, I mean, you, you, you've been in, God, you were in it's the military, difficult. but it, I mean, but, but did, what were your feelings toward, toward, towards my client? Well, I wanted to kill him, to be totally honest with you, and sure. I almost did. Well, wait, 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 wait. When you, when you say kill him, you mean like, like figuratively, like I want to kill him. Like, I want to kill that guy. Or like you no, no, I sat across the street with a crossbow. I was going to kill him. Like, literally kill him? I had it cocked. I you were going to come him. into the courtroom with it? No. No, it was where he actually was working. Wait, wait, wait. wait. So, wait, back How up. How is he working? So, wait, wait. Uh, let's back up for a second. So, when when, in, when in time is this? You, 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 this is you, after, uh, yeah, this is right when he was out doing his thing before we had the trial. So, no, it just really started eating on me. So, let me put it in, so, so, I'm going to put it in perspective. So, he had been in jail, so we follow the timeline. Yeah, he, okay. he got yeah. arrested about a couple weeks after the incident when they put the case together. He was held with a hundred thousand dollar bond. He could not bond out. Yeah, I finally was able to get a bond for him when I was able to tell the or show the judge that evidence was manufactured and that they were intentionally delaying it. Really, what I got the the motion because they had to produce all this evidence right. for me. And I said, "Listen, I, they are continuing this case. They need to produce this to me." I need to be given a benefit of, of getting my client get out of custody. He gets out of custody. It was still about 90 days after that before we had our trial. So right. he's out of custody. I was going to kill him then. Okay. You know, so he's out. Because, during the trial, he's not in custody. Right. After he got out, okay. I figured, okay, this is my <laughs> opportunity to opportunity to make it right. Well, it was, so so uh, uh, when he gets released from custody, mm -hmm. yeah. you, this is what I need to hear. You, you hatched a plan? Yeah. I was going to kill him. When you said you, you, <laughs> the hatch to plan to kill him, how were you going to do it? I was going to shoot him with a crossbow. Why a crossbow? Harder. Well, a couple of reasons. Because all this stuff had gone on. I had gotten rid of most of my weapons. I had left a couple of notes in case anything happened to me. You know, this is what you need to do. But wait, wait. When you say it happened to you, what do you mean by that? Well, because I was... Suicidal? Really. Well, not so much suicidal as I was. I didn't care. You know what I mean? I had gotten to the point where... I didn't think about my family or anything else. I just felt like I'm going to take care of the situation, and if I die, I die. Revenge? You know? Yeah, basically. When you say take care of the situation, so if An you, eye for an eye kind of a situation. Well, I understand exactly yeah. what you're saying. So you're saying if you... Or to die in the attempt of right. getting revenge. Okay. You know, people would find stuff, and they would know my reasons for doing what I did.